built the all Georgia Bulldogs team in Madden. Let's see what this team can do. What's good, you guys? It's been years since I've done college themed teams, so I wanted to bring it back. Number one, had to start with the national champions. A 95 overall from just one college is honestly crazy, but it is Georgia, so I kind of expected this. I think the only team that has a chance to be better than this team is Alabama, but that remains to be seen. Regardless, let's go through all the studs on this team. We've got the Steelers new first round pick Broderick Jones who's a 98 overall left tackle I gave him edge protector and secure protector it is kind of weird that these guys have never played a snap in the NFL but they get crazy high overall cards but it's like a rating based on their potential I guess offensive line overall though is really solid we got Ben Jones David Andrews Andrew Thomas and Isaiah Wynn we had two centers and a lot of tackles but there weren't any good guards so that's why Ben Jones is in at left guard and Andrew Thomas is in at right guard but honestly it's still very, very good for a college-themed team. At tight end, we have Lawrence Cager, and the backup actually has to be Andrew Thomas, so hopefully he's not catching passes. Wide receivers are awesome. You've got AJ Green, Isaiah McKenzie, and George Pickens. George Pickens is a crazy good wide receiver in this game. 99 speed, 6 foot 3. What more can you ask for? One of my all-time favorite players of all time, Matthew Stafford is our quarterback. 99 overall with the boost. Amazing accuracy and as for abilities, we've got Gambit, Fearless, and Hot Route Master. That Stafford has a pretty solid release too. It's not the best in the game, but it's all right. And we've got two incredible halfbacks as well. We got Terrell Davis and Nick Chubb. This Nick Chubb is so good. This is one of my favorite team diamonds that ever came out. Freight Train, Bruiser, and Tank. 98 overall, 99 speed, 99 acceleration, 99 break tackle. You don't need much more than that. So that's our Georgia offense. Our Georgia defense is super solid too, but we did have to make some interesting adjustments. So Thomas Davis has an out of position free safety card. So that was amazing. We got this awesome 98 overall free safety. However, no strong safeties, at least none that were worth using. It was interesting that Georgia had almost every single position locked up except for their safeties. Now, luckily they do have a lot of very good corners. So we took 98 overall Tyson Campbell gave him pick artist and put him at strong safety he's six foot one he's pretty physical and he's insanely fast his tackle is 90 his pursuit is 99 his hit power is 82 he's not gonna be the hardest hitting strong safety but i think very serviceable we've got the two new guys on defense as well jalen carter who is now an eagle 6'3 300 pounds and 98 block shed 99 power moves that should be an incredible d tackle and we've got nolan smith as well also a philadelphia eagle this is damn near just an eagles theme team 99 speed 99 acceleration six foot three just crazy good left outside linebacker interestingly enough though the only gold 99 on this entire team is champ bailey but this champ bailey is ridiculously good we've got acrobat and deep out zone ko 99 speed 99 acceleration you get the idea in fact champ bailey has 99 in almost every single stat speed excel agility jump play rack man zone pursuit such a good card we got keely ringo we got eric stokes lorenzo carter jordan davis jalen carter justin houston trayvon walker quay walker roquan smith nolan smith that's actually weird the left side of our line is the walkers and the right side is the smiths all right boys that that is the Georgia theme team with a 95 offense and a 95 defense. It's so crazy that that's all from one college. Ooh, I am also in the playoffs. So I guess the Georgia theme team is headed into the NFC Championship. Also want to give a huge thank you to SeatGeek for sponsoring today's video. SeatGeek is the number one rated ticketing app. So if you need to buy tickets for anything, make sure you have the SeatGeek app on your phone. For example, near me is an upcoming Diamondbacks game. I can get tickets as low as $27 each and SeatGeek shows me the entire arena with price indicators. Green is good and red is bad. So you always know you're getting the best value for your purchase. Also, you can use my promo code MMG for $20 off your first order at SeatGeek. The link is in the top of the description. And again, that's promo code MMG for $20 off at SeatGeek. Enjoy the rest of the video. Top three for Georgia Stafford, Champ Bailey, and Tyson Campbell. He's got McNabb, Ray Lewis, and Jimmy Smith. Night game at the Eagles Stadium? Holy shit shit holy shit you know we had to rock the eagles unis for this come on man first and ten he's gonna go stretch right oh i'm missing got rocked all right second and six this is a pass uh oh that's a bad ball tyson campbell tyson campbell with a big hit 
and an INT at strong safety already in two plays. That worked out better than I ever could have possibly imagined. We'll start out with a run here. Going to Nick Chubb. Not getting much. Oh, I got it. What a play. <laughs> Stafford. Holy shit. That was a monster play. All right, first and 10. Let's see if we can replicate that success. Ooh, check down. Check down, Nick Chubb. Just take the hit. Yup. So we got tank four. That's a tight window and a bad ball. Oh, oh, oh. That could have been an INT, 100%. Third and five. I'm going to run the football. I know it sounds crazy, but I... Oh, my God. Let's go. Nick Chubb. Great running. Oh, oh. Third and five, pick up 14. I'm going to give Nick Chubb a route over the middle. Does he see it? Oh, he doesn't. He's late. Nick Chubb, carry. Nick Chubb is literally carrying. Let's go. He calls a timeout. He didn't like the pace. I was hitting him with the no huddle. Let's go right at the middle this time. Got a solid old line, man. We can do this. Right at the middle. Good blocks. Nick Chubb will take four. Can't complain about that. Chubb over the middle. No. Oh, that was a touchdown if we could get it. Damn, it bonked off an old lineman. Fourth and goal from the five. I'm going for it. He's adjusting. He's on young blood. Patience, patience. We got to be patient here. No, how did he get free? <laughs> You're kidding me. I had, I had five linemen and he just walked through them. Oh, I could have had so much time back there. Yikes, boys. Turnover on the five. Damn, he picked up a lot of yards there. All right, let's... I think this is play action. I'm going to try and sack the QB. Yup, yup, yup. Let's go. Nolan Smith with a sack right there. Let's go. Ooh. Taking a shot at Eric Stokes. Oh, almost tipped it up and caught it. He took a shot, though. Damn. Good defense. Third and 18. Okay, that's mine. Eric Stokes will come down with it. Oh, turn it. Damn, playing great defense. Let's see if I can get the ball in on offense. I got to get Nick Chubb coming across the middle. If he's not going to guard this, I'm going to take it. If he's not going to guard it, I'm going to take it. I just got to keep hitting that. I can always hit George Pickens too if he starts to key on it. Dude. Oh, oh, Nick. No. <laughs> That's a fucking crime. That's a crime. I don't know in what universe. That is how physics work. But that is a fucking crime. You know what makes that suck even worse? Is that Nick Chubb is not able to catch it. Like, it won't let me, as Nick Chubb, go try and catch that football. But he's more than welcome to catch that somehow. Goose egg. Sorry, boys. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry for how this game has gone so far. I'd like for there to be some points up on the board. Great defensive play by Trayvon Walker. Or was that Quay Walker? I got two Walkers in here. I think it was Quay. Hey! Oh my God, we got home. Trayvon Walker is in there with Nolan Smith. My linebackers are so fast. Third and 16. Let's see where he goes here. Good defense. Hey, great tackle. Fourth and seven. It's going to be the two-minute warning. We could get another turnover right here. Going to need some good defense here. Fourth and seven. Does he block the hat back again? I think the answer is yes. Oh, he doesn't. He actually ran a route. And he broke the fucking tackle. Stokes! Hell of a play and hell of an angle. Still got a shot to shut this down. Okay, this is QB sneak. Oh, my God. It's not. Oh, ballsy play call. That's a good play call. Damn, this guy's gotten so lucky so far. This is such a bummer. All right, seven to zero, unlucky. Let's go score. We gotta win this game, man. It's a playoff game. If it's man coverage, I'm going cager. If it's zone, I go pickens. It was zone. Oh. So I don't know what just happened there. His user was front. Oh, did his, did his controller die? Holy shit, if his controller died, we gotta go. <laughs> I think his controller died. <laughs> Oh, this is fucked up. This is diabolical. We got to stay in it, though. Or is, is he playing me? Is this like a galaxy brain strat? Oh, shit. It might be. Stafford using those legs. Getting three yards. All right. He was back. He came back to his screen there. Third and two. 15 seconds left. This is like crucial. Crucial time right now. Oh, he's there. Got him. Pickens. George Pickens is... Fucking teleporting through the fans. He's sucking that guy off. Yeah, go get him, George. Yo, sick bitch. Look at this. Oh, it's AJ Green. Whatever. Sorry, George Pickens. You weren't sucking him off. It was AJ Green. Seven to seven with 12 seconds left. That's a that's a good. It's a very good 
bounce back drive right there. First and 10, nine seconds left. He's definitely got to go yard. I'm just going to keep sending blitzes. All I'm going to do is send blitzes here so that he didn't have time to throw anything. That should be an INT. That was the same nonsense that happened to him earlier, except unfortunately, I don't have any time to do anything with this. All I could end up doing here is throwing an interception. <laughs> Let's just stat pad. Stat Padford. Ooh, wait a minute. Isaiah McKenzie. All right, Isaiah McKenzie starting us out hot. It's first and 10. Nick Chubb's wide open. Oh, that is not Nick Chubb. That is Terrell Davis, who makes a big hit. No abilities. Nice work. First and 10. I'm going to keep looking at that. I have a feeling he's not going to guard that. I had a feeling he wasn't going to guard it. And what do you know? He's not going to guard it. We'll take those eight yards and we will just keep churning. <laughs> I think he's manned up on it there. He just fumbled the bag. I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. And he's going to be absolutely fucking utterly confused. <laughs> oh my god, I almost just got picked off like that again. Second and ten. Do we think this is man coverage? What do we think about this? Oh, I could have thrown Y. I think if I was still in the pocket, I could have delivered an absolute laser to Y. I literally just didn't have the balls. I didn't have the balls right there to do it. Since this is cover four, though, I might be able to hit Nick Chubb. So glad I didn't because there's a wide open McKitty. Who the fuck is McKitty? And he fumbled. Who is that? And once again, I lose the ball. Fuck, man. Dude, this game has been so unfortunate. What a great drive that was. I mean, we really played that so well. Oh. We got to hit him hard. Woo! Second and 10 got to McNabb, sort of. Ooh, nice throw to Odell. Odell gets rocked, but no fumble. Darn. Ooh, another nice throw, another big hit, and he hangs on. Ah! This is so fucking frustrating. Oh, this is that same play. Throw it to him. Oh, it was an RPO. I thought he was going to throw Megatron. We stuffed it, though. That was nice. I need him to make a mistake. He rolls. Oh, give me that shit. Come on. I've earned this fucking win at this point. Let's go. Let's go take it now. Look at that. What a fucking play. Easy laser, George Pickens. Let's go. Dude, that Quay Walker INT has played a game right there. This is the playoffs, man. No fumbling, no crazy INTs. Let's just get this ball in the end zone, yeah? Great route. Great route from Isaiah McKenzie. Torched his man. Onto the 43-yard line. You're about to see an aggressive chew clock strategy. I'm not letting this game slip out of reach. No chance. Every time. Prime time, there is a 0% chance that you can tackle that man. Zero. Stafford, 17 for 23, 242. And I have only one touchdown on the board. That's crazy. That's all right, boys. Let's power through. He hasn't seen the run in a long time. I'm going to give it to him now. Great blocks. Gentlemen, Nick Chubb powers forward for six. Oh, yeah, he's in trouble. He's in trouble. That two-minute warning's coming up. He can feel it. Nick Chubb, come on, man. You get somebody out there to guard him. You get somebody out there to guard him, and I'll stop throwing it. That'll take us to the two-minute warning. Our boys can get a little breather here. Seven to seven. Holy shit. Second and eight. Let's see what he's got. Oh, yeah. Wide open, Lawrence Cager. Can you fight? Yeesh. Damn, I was hoping he'd run him over and give me the first. He got flattened. Third and two. I get the first down. It's game. I don't get the first down. And uh, we got some more thinking to do. Nick Chubb. Dude, come on. I'm actually like... I'm a little bit frustrated that you're going to let me have that again. 20 for 26, 260 yards almost for Stafford. Coach adjustments, we're going ball carrier conservative. And we're just going to get this into a nice field goal range. Going to keep it simple here. I can't overthink this. Ooh. Second and three. I'm actually going to call the timeout because I would prefer to score a touchdown because my kicker is a punter. I have the Scottish hammer on special teams. Georgia didn't have any special teamers that I could grab. And he's not a good kicker at all. Like he could shank the field goal. So I don't want to run that risk. I would love to just like score. Well, that's not going to happen. Fuck it, man. I'm going to let it go to two. I'm going to kick the field goal. He's going to ice me. I, we technically could go into overtime. I don't expect it. Three... Two seconds on the clock. There's our timeout. He'll wait for me to come out and he'll ice me. The Scottish Hammer, the lefty punter, is going to come out here and kick an ice kick. Let's see how it goes, boys. Here we go. Fuck. Fuck. Ah! I don't know. 
I really don't. He got it. He got it. Sorry, Andy Reid. I don't know what to say, man. Get gooder. Whoa! Dude, I'm so sorry to be negative, boys. That game was tough. The fumble was tough. The INT was tough. But damn, you know what? We fought. We played excellent defense. And that last drive, I think I burnt four minutes. Look at the player stats here, boys. 20 for 26, 260, a touchdown interception. He had, he had four interceptions. And I only scored 10 points. That's so crazy. Nothing crazy, but Nick Chubb, 8 for 66. Cager was 4 for 66. AJ Green, 2 for 40. We had a really good game there. An interception for Tyson Campbell, 2 for Eric Stokes. Play of the game was right here. This is the play of the game, man. He's about to get another touchdown. I see the playmaker. Quay Walker steps up and... Ooh, gets two feet down. What a play. Also, like, who is this bum? Who is this bum that got absolutely flattened? Just got eaten up by Sean Taylor. This was the most diabolical play of the game. You ready for this? Look at this. Nick Chubb pass. It's in his mitts. But okay. It teleports to his knee. That's fine. It teleports from his knee to Julius Pepper's shin. Back to Nick Chubb's back left foot into the sky where Nick Chubb can't catch it, but Julius Peppers can. That is fucked up. Regardless, this was an awesome game. I don't know if I'm gonna keep doing college theme teams. I wanna see your guys' reaction to this one first, but if you love it, I would love to do some more of the big name colleges. But yeah, it's been a blast. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.